as a common switching device, the disconnectors are often used in combination with the circuit breakers, mainly used for the switching operation of the isolated power, and for connecting and cutting off the circuit with small current and other occasions. It does not have the arc extinguishing ability on its own. In this lesson, I will lead everyone to learn about the the abnormal phenomenon of disconnectors and the relevant handling. The main abnormal phenomena of the disconnector include the heating of the contact part of the disconnector, cracks and damage to the supporting insulator of the disconnector, and the failure of the dis disconnector to open or close. The reasons and corresponding solutions are shown in the table, which we will discuss in detail later. The handling for the severe heating of the bus side knife switch. For the connection method of single bus, first, if the bus cannot be powered off in a short period of time, it should be reported to the dispatching department to reduce the load and strengthen the monitoring. Second, when the heating is particularly severe, notify the dispatch to transfer the load and uh, de deactivate the circuit breaker of the circuit. Third, if there is a bypass, the composite load can be reversed to the bypass belt. When the bus can be powered off, the heating knife switch should be repaired again. For the connection method of double bus, Firstly, if the, if the knife switch of a certain bus bar heats up, it should be reported to the dispatch department. The line can be switched to the another section of bus for operation. Secondly, it should be reported to the dispatch and operation departments. When the bus can be powered off, the load should be transferred to facilitate the maintenance of the heating knife switch. Thirdly, the load should be switched to the bypass belt. The handling for the severe heating of the load, load side knife switch. The disconnector can continue to operate depending on the situation, but it needs to be closed monitored until the power outage maintenance can be carried out. The abnormalities of the disconnector include the failure to open and close, inadequate closing, etc. First, the handling for the failure to close or open. When the disconnector fails to open and close, the contactor action, motor rotation, and the action of the transmission me mechanism should be observed to distinguish the fault range and report to the dispatching agency. Regarding the handling of failure to open and close, detailed information will be provided later. Secondly, the handling of not being able to close in place or in different phases of the three-phase system. First, if the knife switch cannot be fully closed in place during operation and appears the poor contact, the heating may occur during operation. Second, when the knife switch fails to close properly and the three phase is in different stages, the closing and opening should be operated repeatedly for several times. The action should comply with the operating essentials and the force should be appropriate. Thirdly, if it cannot be fully closed and it is not possible to achieve complete synchronization of three phases where the insulation gloves and use the insulation rods to push the three phase contacts of the knife switch into place. Fourthly, report to the operation department to arrange the planned power outage for maintenance. Thirdly, the handling of automatic stopping midway during electric opening and closing operation. The fault of automatic stop of the knife switch during electric operation 
is often caused by the premature opening of the operating circuit or poor contact in the circuit. Report to the operating department and arrange the planned power outage for maintenance. Fourthly, the handling of the locking failure of electrical circuit and the error prevention devices. The operator should check if their operating procedures are correct. If their procedures are correct, they should stop the operation and report to the station master. The, the, the station master determines that the error prevention device is malfunctioning and reports to the dispatch and safety supervision department for approval before releasing its lock for operation or treating it as a defect. The operation can only be carried out after the maintenance personnel handle it normally. In addition, there are also treatments for the freezing and the rusting that affect the normal operation. As shown in the table, the handling of the disconnector failing to open and close should be analyzed based on the specific situation. For example, when the contactor does not operate, the equipment name and numbers should be checked first and see if there are any errors in the operating program. If there are any errors, it is considered that the operating circuit is blocked and the circuit is not connected. The incorrect operation should be corrected. If it is not a misoperation, the operating power supply should be checked to see if it is normal. The fuse should be blown or the contact is poor. If there are no problems, the disconnection point in the circuit should be identified and the knife switch should be opened after normal handling. If time is tight, the contactor can be manually operated or the knife switch can be manually opened and the operation department should be reported for professional inspection and handling. Finally, let's talk about the precautions for operating the electric knife switch. First, all control fuses and motor fuses of the electric operation should be removed and centrally managed and handed over according to their values before they can be used during operation. Second, if there are problems with the operation of the electric knife switch, the power analog circuit should be identified before operation. Forceful starting is not allowed, and when the AC contactor is operating, disconnect the knife switch. Third, it is prohibited to manually push the AC contactor during operation to force the running. Fourth, when operating the electric knife switch, attention should be paid to the corresponding relay action. If the relay is not activated, the next operation cannot be carried out. Finally, let's review the abnormal phenomena of the disconnector together. That's all for this lesson. Thank you.